Hello, this video is going to show you how to create labels in Google Keep so you can organize your notes. You can see I'm already logged into my school account. I can see my picture up here, but if I wanted to switch over to my personal account and use Google Keep there, I can switch back and forth and it will just open another tab. On the left side, you can see that I already have some labels set up. Classroom, contact information, tech blogs, different labels to help organize. And in my notes, I can see different notes that already have been put into specific labels. Now, if I have a note that I've already created and I want to place it in a label, I can open it up or I can leave it shut either way and click on the three dots. I have an option to add label. Now, if I have a label already created, I can just choose it and it will go there. But if I don't, and I want to create a new one, I can do it right here also. So I'm going to create a label called sharing. And I hit enter. And there it shows sharing right there on my note. And it, on the left side, I can see sharing also. If I create a new note, and if I can spell correctly, I can do the exact same thing. I can go right here and I can add a label and I could choose one that's already there and it will get put into that label. And I wanna go ahead and add a color to it and I'm gonna just do gray and I hit done and I see that it says sharing. Now, if I have one already created and I'm gonna use this one and I decide I don't want it in that particular label, I want it somewhere else, I can click on more and I can choose change labels. And I can choose a different label. If I want it in multiple, it will go in multiple. Or I can just choose one and it will go in that label also. So you can see if I have multiple labels applied to a note, it will show right there on the note. And if I don't want a label, that's fine too. I don't have to put it into my labels. So right now I'm under notes, so I see all of my notes. But if I just want to see the ones I have in classroom, I click on that label and there's those notes. And my contact information, nothing in that label anymore. I have my sharing label. Another thing I want to point out, we've talked about how to share notes. If somebody shares a note with you, you're going to see who shared it with you. So this is one that Nish shared with me. And I have one down here that was shared with Sheila Opsel from St. Clair and Rick Snyder, the principal at Blue Earth. So I know that they have notes as well. Labeling is just a great way to organize things along with color coding, but the labeling lets you see in a smaller picture the notes that you have in there. So again, Google Keep, getting things organized, creating labels, very simple way to organize your notes and help you stay organized. And it's a good tool to teach your students to keep them organized as well.